Hi, I'm Marlo from Wild Food UK, out foraging again on the 15th of October after some lovely rain and some reasonably warm weather, which has uh, meant that loads of mushrooms have been coming up in the last week or two. Uh, I'm unfortunately rotten with the cold at the moment, so please forgive me if I sniff or cough during this video. I'll try and get through it without doing either. Um, down here is a mushroom oh, I've done a video on before. This is our shaggy ink cap. Coprinus comata, so a really, really common grassland mushroom that can come up in late spring, different points in summer occasionally, and then a lot more in autumn. That's when you find your, the majority of your shaggy ink caps. Very fragile mushrooms, as you just saw. Um, this is one. Oh, it's perfect edible stage, really. He's just started to uh, deliquesce, to turn into ink. That was, that's what happens to the caps of ink caps. And uh, because he's going dark at the bottom, I know that this mushroom has roughly a 24 hour shelf life before he's going to be just a, a pool of ink, which you can use in your cooking um, as, a, as a vegetarian substitute to squid ink if you want to dye things black. The ink is a, a usable ink. Um, check my other video about these. But down here, we've got one of the lookalikes. So I like to show people mushrooms together. This is another type of ink cap right here. This one normally grows in clusters rather than singly. But this one here today is growing on his own. And you can see the cap hasn't got the shagginess. But apart from that, he's very, very similar and he's starting to deliquesce as well from the uh, base of the cap upwards. This is the common ink cap. So we've got the shaggy ink cap here and the common ink cap beside it. This one is a good edible, probably get rid of the stem because it's quite brittle and fibrous, but the cap is certainly something that you can add to mushroomy dishes. It's a mild mushroom flavor. Um, this one, is one that was considered potentially edible, but as long as you never touch alcohol, because apparently um, there's something in this mushroom that reacts so badly with alcohol that if you have alcohol within 48 hours, either side of consuming the mushroom, you can be quite violently ill. Um, I'm not sure what the chemical's called, uh, the, the family, but this one is Coprinopsis. Uh, this is Coprinopsis atramentaria, um, and I've a feeling that the, uh, the chemical is called Coprinol or something like that, but you can correct me in the comments underneath if you want to. Either way, um, this mushroom is now no longer considered edible, even if you're not drinking. It's a mushroom that's considered mildly toxic. So when you're picking your ink caps, go for the shaggies, not the smooth ones. Coprinus comatus not Coprinopsis atramentaria. And if you want to find out more, go to www.wildfooduk.com.